Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video of Echoey Room. I do apologise again. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys had a good Christmas. If you haven't already watched my What I Got For Christmas video, then you definitely should. I'll leave that link down below for you or at the end of this video on the end card section. Anyway, today I'm going to be doing a clothing haul. I have so many clothes to show you and so many things which I've bought recently. A lot of these I got in the Boxing Day sales, so this is kind of like a Boxing Day sale haul. If you want to call it that, I might call it that, we'll find out. I think I'm just going to get started. The first thing which I have to show you is this hoodie here which I'm wearing. I feel like I've started a habit of wearing what I'm hauling, but the first thing which I got is from Nike. It is this kind of off grey, off white colour. It has Nike Air in like silver and then it also has, where is it, on the arms as well. It says Nike Air and I just really like the colour and the combination with the silver. This was, oh I just like literally took it off. This was £60 reduced to 40, you're gonna focus, I don't know why you see this. So this was 60, reduced to 40, and then I also got, um, because it was like January sales, I also got like 30% off that, so I think it ended up being about 34 pounds or something like that. And I love it and it's really comfy, it's like a half zip with pockets down here, and I just don't own much like it, I don't own anything in this colour, so I really, really like it. Also from Nike, which I got was this set of three headbands. I don't own very many headbands but I've been watching a lot of fitness bloggers and fitness YouTubers recently and they always have a good set of headbands on them so I loved these colours, the combination of like green, white, black with like the gold foil um, print um, branding on it so I got this and these were £14 reduced to, um, ooh, let me work this one out. I think they were reduced to like six pounds. My brain's not working today. So I got those and this from Nike. That's the first stuff that I have to show you. Where should we go from here? What should we do next? I think since we're going gym, I'm gonna continue with gym and then we'll get on to misguided, boohoo, all that stuff. Okay, gym shark, let's do it. So this was actually not Boxing Day sales. These were bought in the Black Friday sale, but because I've been away, I ordered it to my house here. I haven't actually opened this yet because I only got home a couple days ago. So basically, this still is a sale. It's just like Black Friday sale, not Boxing Day. The first thing which I see here is a sports bra, I believe. So, this is what it looks like. I love this colour. It is so pretty. I think I got it in a size small. Yep. In peach pink marl, and this is their seamless sports bra. It looks very, very bright on camera, but I promise you it's more... It is still bright. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. And it's got like a racer back on it. It's a little bit longer. I like sports bras that I can just wear on their own. I don't know if some people feel a little bit weird about that, but I just like wearing a sports bra sometimes because it gives you a lot of freedom. Especially in Barcelona, it's hot in the gym, so I like being nice and airy. And I like this one because it's a little bit of a longer line sports bra. So it doesn't look like you're just wearing a really, really cropped. It's like, I don't know how to describe this. But, I love this colour and it's super pretty. Oh, I got something in the same colour. This is the peach pink vest racer scoop top. And it's in a size small as well. I think I got everything in a size small. It's quite basic, bog standard, black, black, pink vest with kind of low arms but not extreme. And then it's got a hole at the back. Cute. I think this would be nice if you learned this with like a grey sports bra or a white sports bra. It would be a nice combination. Then we have two pairs of leggings which I've got. The first pair, which is in here, are the dreamy leggings in a size small and in the colour black, which everybody goes on about, everybody loves these, so I hope they fit me and I hope I like them. They have the little Gymshark logo here and they look like this and I think these are the long ones, I don't think I got cropped, I think I got full length. Yeah, full length, hopefully they're full length on me, I've got long legs so we don't know, but that is the first pair of leggings and then the second pair of leggings are charcoal and chalk pink in a size small. These are the fit like 
leggings. So they're the ones with the big chunky waistband that says Gymshark on them because I'm basic. Gymshark gal. So there we go. This is actually they look kind of purple. Looks like a wee bit of a purpley colour but it is apparently pink with the grey Gymshark logo on it and the leggings themselves are grey. I just wanted something from Gymshark with like the typical waistband that everybody sees but I didn't want to get the really classic Gymshark. You know the ones with like the grey bits, the light grey bits and the dark grey bits? I um, didn't really want that one because everybody has that and it's just a bit too, a bit too keen. So I thought this was a nice variation on the big waistband style Gymshark leggings. That was my thought process. Next up I'm going to show you a pair of shoes. I got a pair of Converse. These this is what the box looks like. Everybody see a Converse box most likely. So I decided to go a little bit different. I'm not, never worn a style of shoe like this before, but something about them I just kind of wanted to try. I don't know, I don't, don't really know, don't ask. So these are the black and white Converse, the high top ones. I'm not sure, I'm usually somebody who just wears like low top white Converse, but I wanted to spice things up a bit and try something new so I got these they did come my boyfriend ordered these for me and they did he did order them in a size six and a half which is a little bit small for me but I they might fit because not gonna lie I hope they do because it might make my feet like huge so that's what these look like high top black and white converse I'm gonna get on to opening this stuff let's start with misguided because I love and this guy. First dress here, I did order quite a lot of dresses purely because I was looking for stuff for New Year and I've got a few birthdays coming up as well so I wanted a good selection of night out outfits which was what I was going for. So the first dress which I got is, this cost me quite a lot so if it doesn't look that great I'll definitely return this because it was more pricey. But it is that kind of flapper girl style dress that's really on trend at the moment. Looks like this. You cannot, I don't think you can see this. Um, it's got like frills down at the chest area. It's a, it's a v-neck but it's not super low. Um, I have seen dresses of this style that are really, really low cut. But this isn't, isn't too low cut. So like the flappy, flapper style tassels down at the waist as well. This dress also has sleeves on it which is a little bit different from like the classic that everyone's wearing. So these go on to your arms and flow down your arms as well. So that's what that looks like. Hopefully you can see it okay. And that was in a size small, small? Small, size six from Misguided. Also from Misguided I decided to be a little bit more adventurous and pick myself up a pair of trousers. These were in the sale and I think they were reduced to something crazy cheap like eight pounds or something. So they are these red trousers. I'm sure you've probably seen them on Instagram or something. They're kind of like all over the place right now. Um, so they've got an elasticated waist. I got these in a size six and they do fit really really well so they are quite quite small and then the bottoms flare out like this but as much as I do love these there's a limit to how many times you can wear them because they're so bold and such a statement but because they were quite cheap I think I'll just keep them and see um, when I can get my wear out of them also because they're flares I feel like the only way I can wear them is with heels so very limited amount of times I'm gonna be able to wear these but they're really nice and they feel really good quality so I am very impressed and they were very cheap. So from Misguided I got this bodysuit here which I actually wore on Christmas Day. So I ordered, I have two Misguided orders. Two Misguided orders. This one came before Christmas and this one was an after Christmas one. So I wore this top actually on Christmas Day. It is a high neck top and it's this really, really good quality. Um, like silky style white material and the arms are long sleeved but with cutouts so if you look on my Instagram I'll link it down below um, your arms like pop out and then it comes back and joins you at the, <laughs> the wrist I don't know if I'm describing this very well it's a bodysuit though so it tucks in really nicely into jeans looks very smart very classy and sophisticated which was good for Christmas Day so 
I really like this and as I said already worn it so check it out on my Instagram if you want to see what it looks like on and how I styled it even though it wasn't that adventurous another dress so this is recently I've been having an obsession with suede everything suede I love and you'll see from now on in this haul that there's so much suede in this haul I don't know I just love it I think it's so pretty and it looks so so nice it makes clothes look more expensive in my opinion so I got this dress in this kind of pale nude slightly pinky color and it's just a suede bodycon dress it goes it's pretty is this upside down this is upside down <laughs> it's pretty short it is a mini kind of bodycon dress it's got a gold zip at the back I do like this, it was extremely cheap, I'm literally saying like £6 this cost me, reduced from like 20 so gonna keep this, give it a shot styling it, I'm never super comfortable in bodycon bando tops because I feel like it's so much like skin everywhere is showing, there's, um, there's just a little bit too much skin for my liking but love this material so I just can't help but keep it properly. Also from Misguided, I picked up this little crop top here. This was crazy reduced in the sale as well, like the other one. So, I love it. This is just like a peachy, um, moavey, peachy? Pink, moavey nude shade. And it's that bandage style, so it's got the like ribbed kind of feel to it. It's pretty cropped, so you definitely need a really high-waisted pair of jeans or a skirt to go along with this. Otherwise, you're going to have a lot of belly showing, but I do really like it. I like the colour. If you've got a good tan, it'll look pretty good. Next, I'm going to move on to Boohoo, because I only got one thing from Boohoo. I do love this. I wore this yesterday. Not yesterday. Two days ago now, I think. There's a photo on my Instagram of me wearing it. It is a one-shouldered white top with like a frill. So it's got two frills here. Sorry that everything's white and you probably can't see it very well, but I do love this. One thing, one criticism is it's not a bodysuit, which I was really, really hoping to find. I really like this style of top at the moment. I think it's really, really nice, really classy and very easy to style. I was just really hoping for one that was a bodysuit, but I couldn't find one anywhere. So I got this one. I've still made it work. I'm still happy with it, but... If it was a bodysuit, it would be 10 times better. I got one thing from Pretty Little Thing, and it is this skirt here. This was, again, reduced in the sale, which I was happy about. It is this bodycon style skirt, but it does flare out, but it is, I don't know how to describe this. It's tight all the way to here, and then it's got this frilly bit at the bottom. So it's not bodycon, but it is tight fitting, and it does fit your figure really well. I got this in a size 8 and it's the snake skin. I'm not honestly a fan of snake skin that much but there was something about this I feel like I could make it work and for some reason I just was attracted to it and I really like it. I think it would look super good with a black belt and then a white top tucked in. That's kind of my my image of what this is going to look like. Um, it is pretty short. I do have to like warn you if you're a tall person like myself. This is pretty short but I do like it so. So this is my muffle bag from In The Style and I got quite a lot from In The Style. Something which I absolutely love and my sister actually doesn't like it but I really really like this style of skirt or skirt even. So it looks like this, it's a size, in a size 6. It looks like this. It's one of the skirts which have shorts underneath so you are safe from flashing your pants. It has um, like two frills on it similar to my white top which I like so you can swoosh it out and have a little floaty skirt on so yeah I've been looking for shorts or skirt like this for quite a while now so I picked this up from in style going along with my suede current trend obsession is this dress here I don't plan on keeping both but I might end up keeping both. So it is a midi dress. It has these spaghetti straps and this front goes straight across your body. 
It is bodycon, figure hugging, and then it's got a little, ooh, I can't show you this, <laughs> and then it's got a little slit at the bottom. It's pretty plain. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to keep this, but I love the material and I just can't help but like it because of the material. But really, I'm not sure if I need both because both dresses are quite similar. Also, crazy, crazy similar. I got this. This is a skirt. It's kind of a similar style actually to this skirt here. It is um, suede though. It is nude suede and it's got that frilly bit at the bottom. This doesn't fit as well. It's not as tight as I would like it despite being a size 6. I'm a little bit disappointed because it's not super super tight but it is nice. I just love the feel of this material. I'm just such a sucker for suede. That is what it looks like here. Another skirt. You can tell I really like frills at the moment and really like suede. That's my two my two things right now. So continuing on with the suede theme. I'm sorry if you don't like suede. So this is a red. So this is a blue bodycon dress. It is a mini dress so it comes just over your bum and no more. The back of it is lace up and it's got like blue spaghetti straps. Goes straight across your body. Looks like this and of course it's suede. And then finally from in the style I got a pair of trousers which are the, what's her name, Sarah Ashcroft range and they look like this. They are a little bit funky though because they've got this little kind of ruched bit at the waist and they kind of like frill over but I love the colour of these, they fit really well and they're super long, they look like this. So they're really nice, love this like peachy pinky colour, peachy like nudie pinky colour and they're really good quality and fit really well. So I picked up these. So I believe that that's everything which I have to show you currently, I think. I always end up finding things last minute, that's kind of why I end up doing Once I go to edit this video I bet I'll find something that I need to include. Let me know if you like this video by giving it a thumbs up, that would be really, really great. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. And also, don't forget to check out what I got for my Christmas in my last video which I uploaded. And I will see you guys soon in my next video. Bye guys!